And the Pro Challenge Festival continues. So we got to uh, we're not playing as a list of steamer yet. Yeah. We're going to be playing as Chad Muska. Here we go. Going back to San Fran. Where all the happiness is. Then we gotta go to San Francisco again one more time before we move on. Where's this pro challenge? I think it's over here. Yeah, it is. Just as I thought. But Chad Muska did make you. She has been there at the 2000. Uh, in 2000, when he won that award or whatever. Or gold medal. Chad Muska is both an accomplished pro skater and a musical artist. Though his Muska's Beats label, he off offers a fresh take on hip hop music. For Muska, the, the two worlds of skating and music are inseparable. Time for some scratching. So, you want to make an album with us? Well, we're yeah. going to have to hear some beats first. Nail tricks and combos to increase your beat meter. Don't bail. Nail eight beats, and we got us a deal. You got a deal. <laughs> doing tricks, you know. Get a high score. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah. Look at that high score. That's what all the record executives say. That's Chad Muska's movie. Skateboarding and music have always been. Too Man, look how young he was. The energy and music to make me want to do the tricks that I do in skateboarding. You know, I've been producing for about six years. Now we've been working really hard on this album for like the last two years solid. You know, it came out the next year, I believe. I've been putting his music, and uh, we got my first album together. It's called Muska Beats One Two One Two. 
we got a couple of the tracks, you know, we got the biz. Track Very hard to find uh, album now. And um, Melly Mel track going to the video game. So, you know, y'all be able to play some crazy skate moves and listen to my tracks. It's going to be on. Yeah, check out the thing Vice did on him. There's a video on Chad Muska that's actually really interesting. To me, skateboarding is it's something that you'd love to do, and there's no rules. I think all sports have rules, and skateboarding has no rules, and it never will have rules. Skateboarding no. Is skateboarding is about having fun with your friends and kicking it and going out and riding it and having a good time. That's the main thing. If you can get on a skateboard and ride down the street and you have fun doing it, and even if you're slamming on your ass, it's all good as long as you have fun. You know what I'm saying? Totally. Absolutely. That's something we're missing. Everything's too competitive these days. You know? Where's the fun? And stuff. We don't have that these days. Or at least I don't see it. That place got demolished. This must be old. That was in Venice. Yeah, I always love Chad Muska. Skateboarding for life. The fact that he's still skating to this day, it's pretty cool. I respect that. Very much so. So now we go back. To the menu. We go to San Francisco one more time. <coughs> then move on. <laughs> Kareem Campbell. See, you know what you was doing. It must be long hair, yeah. Well, so now we do Kareem Campbell's Pro Challenge. Which is up there, actually. <laughs> On Pier 18. I'm here. Roof Gap Challenge. Kareem is known for his smooth style and flawless flip tricks. He's also the first person to kick flip the Gons Gap, proving he can also step up to the big gaps when needed. Can you showcase both of his skills together? Yo, yo, Remo, baby! It is time to take it to the rooftop. Use your entire bag of flip tricks. Bust the tricks across the roof gap so they won't pop. Survive long enough, and we'll want to see you do some combos. Sure. <laughs> So just keep doing this. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. No, a hard flip, Kareem. <laughs> Time for some combos. All right. Oh. Oh, I see. 
Oh, you can't do that? Okay. You can't do two because... This is the intended way. There's lots of things. Can't say eye to eye. I think this is what they're. Yeah. Okay. I know. Call me a. Not a real gamer. The game's broken. You didn't do it right. I know. I'm going to hear it in the comments section. Save your breath, alright? It's been. I don't know how long since I've played this. Seven years? I don't know. It's been a while. Wake up. I'm this stupid fantasy. I did wrong. Okay, yeah, this is this is what I meant to do. It's really not hard. There's ways you could do it too, I mean. You just keep jumping. <laughs> All right, here we go. Shoot. 
Wow, that actually counted. Remember this being a lot easier? Because there really aren't that many. I thought I did that. weird dream. I was in a video store and Jackie Chan and Chris Tucker were working there and they like real, were filming a movie for something. It wasn't Rush Hour 4, I can tell you that. Weirdly enough, you would always kind of wanted it to be. But it is what it is. All right. Oh, you can just all right, that makes everything so much easier. stuff I'd be like okay I almost got it too Thank you. 
Oh my lord, really? See if there this is okay. No more messing around. Just they're too fast, that's the problem. Should be a piece of cake, but I don't remember it being this freaking fast. I really don't. Combos are really going to screw me up. I thought it said inward singing. I was like, wait, what? Uh, oh. Oh my lord. Uh, I can cheese this. That took longer than I thought it would. Not gonna lie. Yeah, we're saving. Shouldn't have taken as long as it did. Let's watch his movie. He's still around. Great skater, too. Yeah, he's always been cool. A lot of really cool footage of him skating all through the years. I believe he's still skateboarding. I believe so. Oh, we're going to visit that area in another Tony Hawk game. And I got replaced my battery. Sweet. So the next time that we're going to play this, we're going to be at Alcatraz.
probably with BAM or at least a steamer, one of the two. Alright, see ya.